Hello everyone. Can you believe that I've had these boxes for a couple days and haven't even looked in them? Um, I actually wanted to wait and do this in front of you. So, give me a second here. Even yesterday, when Norwex showed us the new products, <laughs> I was like, nope, I can't open these. I gotta wait and do it in front of everyone. So this one uh, actually says surprise inside. So I think I know what this one is. Um, or maybe I don't. Let me see, hang on a second. Okay. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know about this. Congratulations on becoming the number 11 top group leader. Over the past year, you've chosen to dream big, set big goals, and you have achieved big results. We are inspired by your dedication, and we are extremely thankful for who you are and your contribution to our mission. Congratulations on outstanding achievement, Judy and Debbie. I did not know that this was in here. I thought this was the new host reward package, so this is kind of cool. Who doesn't like cousins? This is exciting. Okay. All right. Check this out. Sorry, guys. This is not the new product. <laughs> it's coming. Oh, this is nice. I know totally what I'm going to do with this frame. So this is a beautiful frame. It says Norwex on it. And I am definitely going to, next conference, make sure that I get a picture of myself with my awesome team and put it in there. So that's what I'm going to do with that frame. So everyone who attends conference needs to be in that picture. Okay. Next. This must be the actual new products. I have two boxes here. I thought they came in three, which is why I thought that was kind of part of it. So keep on going. Sorry this is taking so long. I actually want to show you that I legit didn't open the box. <laughs> oh, it's wrapped so pretty. Okay, package seven. Doesn't really matter, I guess. I didn't know they came like this either. This is hilarious. And guys, if ever you receive packages and have this brown paper, do this with them. Um, what I have my kids do actually is all my paper from the year that come in my Norwex boxes, I have them color on them and make like pretty um, Christmas. I feel like I'm missing. There must be some, oh no, I'm not, never mind. Um, anyways, I have the kids color on the, the paper and then we use them as wrapping paper instead of buying wrapping paper. Saving the trees, right? One tree at a time. Okay. Package one. Let's see what we got here. Oh, okay. Shoot. This would have been much better yesterday. <laughs> Yay, new products. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess that's probably not part of the lineup. On to package two. <laughs> oh, too funny. Okay, well, let's actually start with this one. So this is the... This is kind of weird. Oh, that is package two. Okay, one sec. This is the new bonus booking gift. How cool is this? So the way that Norwex is doing this now is when you get multiple bookings, which is awesome... Um, obviously helping us to spread the mission even better by getting into more homes, then the hostess is going to get all this awesome stuff. So this beautiful, exclusive, limited edition window cloth. How gorgeous. That is stunning. This is stunning. I think I'm going to have to host my own parties <laughs> a few times because I think I would like a few of these. This is the most beautiful window cloth I've ever, ever seen brought out. And then this gorgeous purple color enviro cloth with the graphite trim. 
and an exclusive purple dust mitt as well, which is also stunning in color, of course, and an optic scarf. So before, as all of you probably know, you would get a window cloth, right? For every booking. Um, this is amazing because now if you we do a party and we get a booking and then a couple more bookings, etc. Now we get this whole amazing package or the hostess rather. I'm talking about me because I'm gonna host my own party to get all this awesome stuff. But the hostess will get all this amazing stuff, which is great. And then this cute little adorable clip-on mini optic scarf. I think that is adorable. How cute would it be on a beach bag? Uh, easy traveling, super neutral. So boy, girl, doesn't matter. Um, for a boy, you might wanna cut off the purple tag. Um, up to them, obviously, but super cute. All that stuff, all of it, instead of just a window cloth. That is awesome. Okay, next, package two. This one's probably breakable, I'm guessing, after seeing the new products yesterday. Okay, so this is like Christmas morning, <laughs> except I will say, um, it's really great um, when you're in the senior leadership a group of consultants with Norwex, you are able to purchase the products ahead of time. So these, this is the same offer that all consultants receive who attend conference as well. Um, so all this stuff is product I paid for. Unfortunately, it's not just an awesome gift from Norwex. I did pay for it, but it is super fun that I do get to have it to show you guys right away. Very exciting. Okay. I love that I have all this tissue paper now too for the next little while. Okay. So this is the glass foaming hand wash dispenser uh, with a silicone lid. I am really excited about this. Something that I always, I've, I love our peppermint hand wash. Like I love, love, love it. I've never loved this on my counter. I've gotten used to it. It's okay. I just have always thought it was so nice when people have really nice soap dispensers on their counter. And this is absolutely beautiful. I don't know if you guys can see the little dotted texture. So it is more than just a plain bottle. It has a silicone bottom, which is gonna prevent it from slipping around on your counter, falling, breaking, um, and just, oh, it's, it's, it really is, it's gorgeous, it's gorgeous. These, I know, are gonna do so well, so, so beautiful. Um, and then you can put in our brand new, if you don't like peppermint, unscented foaming hand soap that is so exciting um i know throughout the years i have had several customers say do you have hand soap that doesn't have a scent i'm highly sensitive to scents so this is going to be huge for anyone who has uh, scent sensitivity so absolutely excited 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 about that i'm actually going to give this a smell this is the unscented hand soap just because i want to see if there is any scent at all it literally smells like nothing. They did a great job. That's really good. That's really, really good. So that's gonna be awesome for sure. Okay, um, glass sprayer with silicone sleeve. Let me show you what this guy looks like. Oh my goodness, these boxes are not easy to get into. There we go. This is actually a lot bigger than I thought, which is also super exciting. Um, it's like, look, I don't know if you guys are able to really tell how large that is. Here, let me show you to my coffee cup. It's very big, in a good way big. There we go. So I thought they were little. Um, just looking on the screen, this is quite nice in size. So um, I picked up one yesterday as well because I thought Addison um, does her hair all the time in the morning and this would be great to have in the bathroom so that she can be spraying it, misting it, getting it wet. I think actually for myself too. Um, as well as obviously diluting products that we have, putting them in here and making a solution that you can be using as a cleaner. So um, obviously you can do the laundry soap and water uh, combination for a deep clean on um, lots of especially white items to spruce those guys up a little bit. And then um, one of our new products, so I will get to that and talk about that too. And of course the bathroom cleaner could be diluted in here and the odor eliminator as well with your water combination, okay? so. A couple uses for these. They come in three different colors. So I'll just quickly open the other one so you can see. And that is nice. Oh, I wonder if that was, oh no, that is gray. I thought it was white. 
and the sea mist color i love that they're different colors because you guys can color coordinate kind of how you want things right so for example i got this one for addison for spraying her hair with water and then um you know maybe i'll use gray for bathroom cleaner and white for odor eliminator that way they're never getting mixed up and the whole household can know which one's which and you know not to spray your hair with odor eliminator for example that would be not good so let me just get these guys out of the way oh my goodness dropping stuff already sorry about that okay next that was package two three package three So the degreaser, um, I forget the amount, so I'm just gonna quickly read that to you guys. Concentrated formula makes five full 16 ounce dilutions, okay? So um, three teaspoons of this mixed in your spray bottle with water and then you have your degreaser um, solution. Yesterday, uh, when I was sitting with one of the girls watching, she said, oh my gosh, this is so great because right now um, her husband where he works has to come in and like clean everything and he has like a really awful, harmful chemical degreaser and she was saying she absolutely loved that we have this degreaser now and she feels a lot better about the fact that he's spraying everything constantly um, with a better solution. So how great is this? And I know that many of us have been looking for a degreaser for a long time. Something I mentioned was I absolutely love our dish soap. Like I really love it. And there's a couple reasons. Um, I notice when you use anything like Dawn, um, ivory, is that, is that even a dish soap? I don't know, whatever the dish soaps are, suddenly they, they make the cloth stink. Like even the netted cloth, they, they make them smell bad. And I know this because recently, in going to my boyfriend's cottage, his mom has the Dawn dish soap and I brought up the Norwex, of course. So I use that, but she uses the Dawn. And every time I go up now, I have to re-clean the cloths because they all smell like the Dawn dish soap. I swear, the stinky cloth smell is not just bacteria ridden. It's like it comes from the fragrance that they put in those soaps. So that's the first reason I don't like them. Um, also, the chemical content in them is ridiculous and they are known to be hormone disruptors and I would just rather not have that in my um, in my like cleaning diet, for example. And same with my kids. I don't want them using hand soaps where they're absorbing SLS and SLES, especially when kids to the age of 18 are the ones that are mostly affected by those harmful chemicals. So no thank you. Um, I'd much rather use our dish soap. However, what's not great about our dish soap? Anybody know? It's not fabulous at cutting grease. So for example, my boyfriend cooked bacon on a cookie sheet last week and it was so greasy. I was like, oh my goodness, like that's how are we gonna, that, how are we gonna combat that? Like the dish soap just will not cut it from Norwex. But I just took half a lemon, squeezed the lemon juice onto the pan, used a little bit of dish soap, voila, totally great. He actually was like, you guys should sell like lemon juice in a spray bottle and charge like $10. I was like, that's kind of funny, but anyways. Then this came out. So I'm totally gonna use this now, spray it on my cookie sheets and stuff, and then just give it a wash with dish soap and done. So I'm really excited about that one. Okay, next. Now I don't have to waste lemons anymore on my dishes. Oh, this is a squeegee attachment. This I um, am really happy about too. Love that it attaches onto the handheld system and um, the fact that I have a glass shower uh, in my bathroom is, this is fantastic. So that will make cleaning the shower a lot easier. I love that our stuff is so versatile, right? You can use this with, um, I mean, the mop handle if you had to get like a really high window or the handheld system, um, the handheld mop system, or window cleaning system, awesome. So our brand new, I would say luxury towels. So soft, you guys. Um, this is the vanilla and graphite color. It's gorgeous, it looks, almost like a shimmer of silver. It's absolutely beautiful. One thing I love about these towels opposed to our regular towels is, um, and for those of you who don't have towels yet, our regular towels are made pretty much like this. They're kind of a flat microfiber. And so you can't really shimmy at all. You have to pat yourself dry 
and then you're totally dry. The towels work amazing. They're the most absorbent towel you'll ever use. But for people that like that, you know, shimmy kind of feel or uh, the way it works, it didn't work um, and doesn't work. But these ones, it does. So you get the best of both worlds. You get the people that are good to be like, blah, 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 done. Or you get the people that want to like shimmy their towel on them and it works great too. So you really appease both everybody in the way that they feel about towels. And like, let's be honest, guys, the Norwex towels are the softest towel in the entire world. Hands down, never, ever, I ever felt a towel that's um, softer. And my kids and their kids, we all know kids are honest to a fault, right? They will say whatever's on their mind. My kids refuse to use any other towel. I'm not kidding you. We go to Great Wolf Lodge, mom, bring the towels. I don't wanna use the rough towels they have. Uh, we go traveling, mom, bring the Norwex towels. I do not wanna use those rough towels. So um, you know what? If you don't believe me that they're that soft, the least you can do is believe my eight-year-old, right? Like that has, they're just truly, truly, truly amazing. Um, what else do I wanna see about these guys? Antibacterial, as you can see, they fold or roll up super, super tiny, right? So this is a generous size towel. I will show you the size. Look how small that is, right? So if I'm like, in comparison to me, um, if I'm putting that on my luggage, I can do that. I can take a towel. And because they're antibacterial and they don't cross contaminate and all that great stuff, I can use it. The kids can use it. I can use it again. I'm just hanging to dry. And like, I only really need one, maybe two, right? So very cool. And look, in case you don't have the towel again, very, very generous in size. And holy mackerel, I just noticed something. They added a loop. Heck yeah hanging in your bathroom just like that. I was hanging them from the tag before, but it hangs really long then on the floor. So that is awesome. It's very exciting. Okay, our new chenille hand towel in our denim color. I am actually so, so in love with this because Dylan has his own bathroom and he has denim towels in his bathroom and now this matches. And the best thing about this is they have now changed this to be micro suede. It is so soft and smooth and it doesn't tend to crinkle. So if any of you guys already have a hand towel, a, a chenille hand towel, you'll notice that um, if you have a round, um, like bathroom, I think fixture to hang your hand towel on, it's hard with the round one because it kind of gets scrunchy, right? But these, like I'm forcing it to scrunch. So this one's gonna sit a lot nicer on your round hand towel holders um, or your bar. So absolutely lovely, 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 lovely. So soft, it feels so nice. I'm really happy about the denim color. It's beautiful. And then the body gloss. This is probably one of my favorite of the new products because I have all this color in my bathroom and I'm always like, not a, none, literally not one. Okay, one. There was one teal in one of the packages. Um, but one body cloth would match my bathroom. So this is awesome. Plus, I just love the fact that this side is softer than what our regular body cloths are made of. So I just thought to take my makeup off and stuff, like this is gonna feel so great around the eyes. Um, you're gonna get that gentle exfoliation, same as before, but even softer. And I feel like as with age, our skin gets thinner and a little bit more delicate. I think this is a great option um, to be taking our makeup off with a softer material. So very pumped about these. Um, and in all, all three colors that the towels now come in for the stripes. So absolutely beautiful. What number am I on? Package four. All right. And then I only have two more. I won't keep you any longer. Three more. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is also bigger than I thought. Oh, you guys. Oh my goodness. Oh, you know what? I'm going to go back to something too that I forgot to mention. Um, the hand soap, um, it does come in unscented. It also is going to be coming in citrus. Take note that the citrus is available in the catalog. Uh, and what I mean by available is available. It is not available. Norwex has very, very high standards. Um, I actually know that their rating scale for standard is very high. So basically if it doesn't rate a 10 out of 10 or like a nine, it's out of the catalog or it's sent back to be remade. Um, you'll notice too, if ever you, uh, there's a product that constantly or consistently is not doing well um, because of the makeup of it, or like maybe it was a bad batch, they will actually send it, they'll, they'll do a recall, get them all back and send um, all the customers that bought it a new one and uh, have the solution 
recreated basically or um, corrected. So anyhow, the citrus soap was made and they were not happy with it. I don't know why, if it was scent or performance, um, but it's not in the catalog, okay? So even though you can see it, you cannot order it. Just take note to that. Um, you might wanna mention that as well um, to anyone who might be looking at ordering it. Okay, this guy, the turtle, so cute. So the turtle is made out of our, our beautiful beach towels, which are not available. They are a limited edition item. Um, you know, sometimes a hostess exclusive or customer special, but it's so soft, you guys. And then the, the sea mist, like what the bath mat is. Oh my gosh, here it is. And then the, and then the kitchen towels. So I love that they've used products that Norwex already carries to create this little turtle. Like, what should I name this guy? I just, he's so flipping cute. Um, I know that Cohen is going to steal him. Cohen is a stuffy guy, even though he's, as so I know he said eight earlier, he just turned nine. He's nine, but he's going to love this. But I think I'm actually going to set this on, I have a little stool in my bathroom and I think I'm going to put that there and they have sea mist in their bathroom. So it's going to look really cute there. I'll take a picture and, and post it later, but how, ad how adorable. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Everyone needs one of those guys. Okay, brand new lint mitt. So this is replacing our old lint mitt. Oh my gosh, that is way better. I can already feel it. If any of you guys have the lint mitt, you know what I'm talking about. Um, it does, if, I mean, if it's nice and you can use it, absolutely. But this one's like, it's firm. Like my hand in there, I can feel that it's it's firm on there. It's not loose or gonna roll around on me. It's very thick material. Um, and then obviously it works the same as one before. If you have pets at all, this is a must have, especially if you have a cat that likes to sleep on your pillow, because if you've ever done this, laid your head on the pillow and then um, <laughs> basically realize that there was a cat on there earlier because you're like spitting it out of your mouth. Um, this is great to have beside your bed just to every night before bed, just kind of get rid of all that cat hair or dog hair or whatever you have, right? So love this. Also great when you are wearing black clothes often too. Okay, next. The Enviro Scrub Cloth. So this is actually a product that I've never really gotten into and not for any reason at all. Um, they're, they're nice, like they're the perfect size for your hand. So I think it's just because I love all of our kitchen stuff so much already that I haven't really opened up to the idea of putting one more thing in there that I already have great products. However, I love these in the bathroom, like love them in the bathroom. They are the perfect size for your hand. Um, when you're like using the scrubby side, like scrub, uh, scrub soap scum with the cleaning paste, um, or and then afterwards to wipe it with this side. I find that because it's shaped the way it is, it's thicker and it has like the sharp corners, not sharp to touch, but sharp angle. Um, you can get in around faucet taps uh, to clean around and get rid of any lime scale or hard buildup and things like that, right? So, or gross stuff that you don't want to touch, right? And get in there, like get rid of all that gunky, gross stuff. So, um, I don't know. You tell me, do you guys have the Enviro Scrub Cloths? What's your favorite use for them? Because that would even help me to advertise them properly because I know that they've been a huge hit and a top seller. Um, and so that's why Norwex created a new color. So tell me what your favorite thing is about them so that when people ask me, I can relate on your uses for them. Cause for net right now, I'm just basically saying, yep, clean your tub and your faucets and all that. Okay. So now we have the small size of the chenille, floor uh, mop pad. This is fantastic. If you guys have pets and you don't have this one, I highly recommend it. Um, me personally, I don't really sell the uh, mini mop system. And uh, if you've ever been obviously uh, someone who ordered from me, you know why. It's because I feel like why have a small size if you can have a large size and get everything done in half the time? I'm all about fast. I need it done right away as fast as possible. You're doing double the work if you have half the size of a mop, in my opinion. That being said, I have sold a few. Where do I sell them? Why do I sell them? If you have a small apartment or a condo or a trailer or a cottage, perfect for that, absolutely. Um, but if you have more than a, you know, a foyer and kitchen of hard floor in your house, 100% if you have a pet, uh, sorry, you need the large pad period, mop pad, um, or mop system. But yes, if you um, have a pet, for sure, for sure, for sure, the chenille mop pad, you will be like, why did I not get this earlier? It's amazing. And then of course, the brand new dish mat. And um, this, this is, I thought, well, I thought, okay, maybe there's, 
I don't know. Okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. Anyways, I love that the color underneath is not white anymore. Like, it's brilliant. I've actually had my gray ones for, or my graphite ones for about a year, I guess. Is that when they, I'm not sure when they came out, a year or two. And they're not stained or marked up or anything. And I actually use it backwards. I like to put the vented side down um, and have the, the microfiber side up. But a lot of people, um, the actual use for it is intended to be the microfiber side down and the, you know, the netted vented side up so that your dishes can dry properly and whatever. But I find it's a little slippery and I actually prefer it the other way and I've never had a problem. I just hang them to dry after. But I think it's great that they now have the same color because I have seen others who have had the odd stain in it or whatever and it's darker. This color is like, it's a, just a slightly darker it's beautiful and um, I think will stain less easily if you have children who put things on them when they're dirty. Anyone? Just me? Okay. So, or husbands. Husbands do that too. And sorry, if you are a husband, maybe your wife does it. <laughs> but I don't know. That's what I find. And then three more packages. They're small. Don't worry, guys. I'll get through this quickly. Ish. As fast as I can. I do not know what this is. Oh, yes. Seriously, I am so excited about this product. Um, you guys, have you ever used a charcoal toothpaste? So here's the thing. I am very much about our brand. I try to buy everything our brand all the time, try to only promote it. And it's because I can. Because our products are so great, I can say, this is awesome. You need this. 100%. I love it. And I really do. Um, and I know that they're going to too because the last thing I want to do ever is get someone, like have someone order something and not like it. Um, so that's why I think our catalog is really fantastic. I think everyone truly loves everything that they order. Um, it's very rare that I hear that someone didn't like something. The toothpaste before was $19.99 and it was a decent sized toothpaste, um, but it, it was only okay. Like I feel like the taste was pretty good. Um, but I definitely felt like I still needed my regular toothpaste in between, in between. And I, I probably will still feel the same way about this one because it does not have fluoride. Fluoride, um, whether you know or do not know, is a harmful chemical. Uh, in the, in the U S a lot of dentists actually don't even use it. I don't know if you know that or not. Um, because it is known to cause, I believe it's, it can contribute to kidney failure. Don't quote me on that, but it's, uh, I believe it's kidney failure. Um, contribute, not be the cause, but contribute. Um, so I like the idea of not having it in my oral care regimen, um, but I also feel like sometimes we need it, right? So I will probably use this every day and then like once once a week use Sensodyne or something. So what I love about this is guys, it's about, I can't remember how many ounces the other one was, but this one is bigger than our old toothpaste as far as how much is in the tube. And this is the best part charcoal toothpaste that's white so sorry i was gonna say something about brand and like uh, always using our brand so i buy I, one thing i do buy that's not norwex is native deodorant i absolutely love it um i'm a huge advocate for what is good our deodorants i found worked but this works for me better so you got to do it better for you. So I use native deodorant and last time I ordered it, it said, do you want a free sample of our toothpaste, charcoal toothpaste? And I was like, sure, it's free. I would never buy it, but it's free. So I got it. I absolutely loved it, but it makes my sink all black and it makes my toothbrush like all black while I'm using it. I have to rinse it really well and then I have to clean the sink and hate that. And then this came out and I was like, shut the front door because now I can buy charcoal toothpaste that's white. That's so cool. And it has natural ingredients in it too, or the charcoal in it will actually whiten your teeth. So Bravo Norwex. That's probably actually my favorite new product. Definitely, actually. Very, very, very excited about that one. Here we go. Okay, so I don't know if you saw my very confused face. I didn't know. They were packaged in two different packages. Less confused now. So we have our graphite, which is graphite now underneath instead of white. Then we have our mushroom. Okay, so I just also was like, wait a minute here. Um, the mushroom with the darker color. So um, I thought mushroom was going to be more brownie. I'm very pleased to say that this is a very beautiful neutral color. So I think all of you, if you put this in your kitchen, would be happy. Uh, very true to color on the camera. So absolutely gorgeous. 
Um, this is obviously the other part of the hint. What the? I don't know. Again, I feel like pieces are, oh, where is that? I don't know. Pieces are not adding up here, but anyways, I think I'm missing one piece in a, in a box. I'm going to find that. The travel pack. Beautiful colors. Brand new. Love them. Very trendy. Um, this is what's in. Norwex is very good at following the trends. So uh, we've maybe stepped out a little bit from the colors we had before and added some new pop with these brilliant colors. Okay, so uh, I think most of you understand what travel cloths are, but in case you're not aware or you're not using them, absolutely right now, this is a must-have product. If you do not have it, get your hand on them ASAP. They are basically your, and I hate to use this terminology, but they are your, I'm going to swear guys, they're your Lysol wipe on the go. I'm sorry for swearing. That's horrible language. You do not need Lysol wipes. I mean, do your thing. Do your thing. <laughs> if you're comfortable with Lysol wipes and that's what you want to use, go ahead. I can speak only from my family and, and for how our family, um, chooses to live and we have not had a harmful chemical in our house in 10 years, 10. And we are healthy, happy, healthy, clean people. So I, I truly believe it is not a necessity. Um, if you feel with what's going on in the world right now that you need that extra um, cleaning process in your home, go for it. Absolutely. I'm never ever going to tell you what makes your mind feel at ease about cleaning your home. But chemicals are bad. They are bad and harmful. They really are. They are known to cause cancer and all these things. And I'm not preaching to you. I'm just going to make a suggestion. If you have the travel cloth and if you have an Enviro cloth, do yourself and your family a favor if you are using those chemicals. And after you've used them and you that, that maybe made your mind feel good, Take an Enviro cloth or a travel cloth, they're the same thing, travel cloth, just smaller, and remove that chemical from your surface, okay? That's all I wanna ask you to do. So if you wanna use them, go ahead. If you feel comfortable in just using Norwex products, even better, because I think that they really do an amazing job at cleaning our surfaces. But I get that some people need more. So if you need more or someone in your family needs more, use it, but then clean it afterwards so that you and your children are not exposing your skin to those harmful chemicals and open windows, okay? That's all I'm gonna say about that. Anyways, and use them properly. They need to sit wet for 10 minutes on a surface without wiping to actually kill bacteria. It is killing me right now to watch waitresses and stuff do this with the table. Shh, shh, shh. That does not kill bacteria. I don't care what chemical you have, it does never, it never ever kills in one minute or one second even. Um, bleach takes 10 minutes. I don't know if you guys know that. Okay, um, the Minister of Health, I don't know if I'm calling him the right name, but um, when he spoke on CKCO News, when he spoke about COVID, he actually said, if you are not leaving your bleach on your surfaces for 10 minutes, you have killed no bacteria. Okay, so that is coming right from the top. Um, actually, he was a high up doctor, but also something with the chemical field. Anyway, I, w I wish I remembered exactly who he was title-wise, but um, it's coming from him, right? So use your products properly and then get rid of them with no rocks. Okay, and then our masks. If you have not yet seen our masks, um, super, super, super nice. And I actually do want to tell you about them because they are very different from our other, like our first batch of masks. So um, the first batch of masks, obviously, were put out for consultants, right? Let's get these guys in the consultants' hands. They can provide them for their family um, and stay healthier as fast as we can. And uh, Norwex did a very good job of getting a product out that was not even in the catalog um, and having them tested by an outside company who proved them to remove 99%. Or, Oh my gosh, I'm talking about bacteria removal now, sorry. 81% of 0.1 microns, okay? And that is from the Nelson Lab in Utah. So it was not tested by Norwex. This is out of house testing. I think that it's important for people to know that, you know, people came back with testing. That is not Norwex related. Um, the first masks were nice. I will give them credit for that. These are nicer. They are, they're, they, I wouldn't say they're thinner. The, the fabric feels the same in thickness. They are lighter. And I don't know how to explain that, but they are definitely lighter. Um, uh, one thing I noticed is that when my kids were wearing the other ones, every time they talked, I was like, what, what? 
what? Like I could not understand that it was like more, more, right? These ones, as you can see, I'm sure that you can still hear me talking. You hear what I'm saying. Um, it's not muffled, right? Like you can hear me. You can also see that even though it's sucking in, it's not like, <gasps> like sticking to my mouth, right? Like, and I have lip gloss on, so that says a lot. Um, it presses against your cheeks. Okay, that is very important because if you cough or sneeze, ideally not sneeze in one of these, but if you do, um, those particles are like so little, they're gonna right out. Um, this is why it's important for people to have a proper mask. When this is basically almost sealing around your face, that is a good mask, okay? That is a very good mask. Um, I've heard many people say that no one is gonna wanna pay $17.99 for a mask if they can go to Costco and buy a, a box of, I don't know, 50 for $25 that are disposable. Or they can buy the cotton mask that somebody made for $10 or um, people are giving them away for free. Okay, I, I get that and I am very frugal. <laughs> I like to save money. Saving money is not going to Costco and buying a box of 50 reusable masks that all get thrown away and then I have to go buy more masks. That's not effective for the environment, for your wallet, um, for anything. So um, like we're already creating a lot of landfill mess right now because we've had to go back to using plastic bags in grocery stores and stuff, right? So I don't know why so many are okay with using disposable masks. Like the garbage it's creating to me is mind blowing. Um, yes, you're gonna pay a little bit more for this, but in the end, I think this is gonna go on for a while. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but we're probably gonna have masks on for a while. Um, if you're buying a box of masks every week, or sorry, every month maybe, every week, I don't even know. It's kind of like the paper towel thing. You're gonna be buying them all the time. So definitely you are going to be over $17.99. Guaranteed. Even if you buy one for your whole family and you spend $100 on masks, I guarantee you, you're going to spend more on disposable masks. The other problem with cloth masks and stuff, most of them do not come that close to your face. They're like sticking out at the sides, folded like this, like the rectangle ones. Let me put a rectangle in front of my face for a minute. I feel like there's a lot of space missing here, right? Like I just feel like People are doing what they can and they're doing their best, but we need to educate people about why the Norwex mask is truly better. There, it's a better material. There's no other fabric that I've heard about that can filter out 81% of 0.1 microns. So if you're someone that's just trying to get it done and go into Costco with your mask on or wherever you may be going and you just wanna go in with a mask, then sure, you know, that rectangle mask might do the job and you get in the store, but are you actually protecting yourself or others? I would say no. You're doing a little bit. You are not filtering 81% of 0.1 microns. You are not covering your surface area with hardly any room for stuff to fly out, right? So again, I'm not trying to uh, be opinionated I'm trying to educate. So I think it's important for us to know price point. What are you getting out of this mask that you're not getting from others? And why is that beneficial? Okay, so something I would personally like to do is offer my customers um, that when they purchase, you know, four, that they get one free or something like that, right? So definitely I will be letting my customers know that they are going to be getting something from me for getting these masks. And you know what? That's because I want them to protect themselves better. So um, I'm not looking to make a ton of money on the masks. I'm looking to protect my my customer base, my family of customers, okay? So I hope you guys um, can get an idea and, and uh, do something like that as well. Okay, um, and just to show you the, the colors here. The star one, um, I actually at first was like, oh, I don't know about that for kids, but it's because I was thinking of my kids who were like 13, 11, and then nine. Um, but actually, like Addison was like, oh my God, that's so cute, but it's not big enough for her. So um, yeah, like I think it's actually quite cute and lots of little kids who have seen it on other kids 
have a, like, and this is from hearing from um, other consultants because I don't have them on my kids. But apparently the kids are like, oh my God, I love that mask. I want that mask, especially littles, like little ones, right? This is like so cute for between like two and like maybe seven or, or seven, six, seven, I guess it probably depends, but so cute. And then this is a geo, uh, geographic one. So what I like about this one is that um, if you can see, like it's not super bold in print. And if I put it on here, doesn't it just kind of look gray? So if someone are look, is looking for like a plain one, I would suggest this one. I know it's not plain, but it's really quite close, okay? It's not very loud. Um, and even the pattern, even though it is there, it's very subtle, okay? So I think that that would, that would be good. This one is a funny story. Have you ever like looked at something and been like, oh, I don't like that? That was me for this one, 100%. I was like, uh, ew, could they have come out with something a little bit more like in your face? But then people were posting pictures of like other consultants who got them were posting their picture. And I was like, oh my, that is actually a beautiful mask. And it like, it really is. Okay, look. I feel like it, it really truly is a really nice looking mask. Um, to each their own though, of course, right? So if you like another one better, then you like another one better. Addison does not like that one at all. So she actually went for the camo, the blue camo. So this is like a, like a very, uh, it's like a gray with a hint of blue in it. Um, it's like a very modernized blue. I don't know if you can get the grasp of the color. It, it's pretty close to what I'm seeing on the camera. So I think it's good. And then I think these are great because one thing, um, I didn't like was going in the grocery store and stuff. And then I would take my mask off and put it in my car, or my cup holder, or like on the, um, on the console or whatever. But then I was like, well, what's on there? And I'm putting this on my face and like our masks are antibacterial, right? So as soon as I'm even breathing in it, the moisture from my breath will make the silver start working and, and make it like a clean mask every time I'm using it, which I love too. By the way, this is a selling point. No offense to anybody, but our breath is our breath. Like it's not always the nicest thing in the world. So if we're breathing into a mask, the next time you put it on, it's like, it's like, um, you know, the hats that go over your face, like a ski mask, and all of a sudden your ski mask, you put it on, you're like, Ooh, or like a scarf, it stinks, right? Because our breath gets on it and it smells bad. Um, I have found that, like, I'm not washing my mask every time. I, I know you can and some people probably are, but I haven't been. I actually haven't washed my mask at all since the first time I used it. And it's been like, what, two, three weeks now, probably? And it doesn't smell at all. Like, I think that that's a really key selling point on the masks is that um, you don't have to wash them as frequently because they don't get as stinky and um, also dirty. But in the car, again, on things or whatever, the kids spill stuff, like maybe someone's eating in the car. I just didn't like the idea of them being sitting, uh, of them sitting there. But now we have these awesome bags. So they're kind of like the wet wipes bag. They feel different, um, but in a way that still aren't going to get like, you know, soaking wet or anything like that, I think if they're in the car. So it's great because you have pocket number one. So you could have, you know, maybe your mask in there and then maybe you have your kitty's masks on the other side or maybe you have your masks in one side and you have your, um, when we have it back, the, like the hand cleaning cream on the other side or a travel cloth for on the go, you know, cleaning carts or whatever it may be, right? And then it's a little wristless, wristlet, sorry. Um, very cute, very nice, very, very well made. Um, the design is very nice. The uh, stitching is great. Like, um, again, Bravo Norwex, they did a great job and made of 100% recycled material. Doesn't get better than that. By the way, all of our products now, ooh, okay, I, I say this lightly because I might be wrong on all of them, but I believe... Um, if not all, most of our microfiber now has 70% microfiber, uh, micro 70 recycled content in them. Sorry. So for example, that would be like two plastic water bottles in, uh, in a viral cloth. Pretty cool. I think that's a wrap. That's a wrap. That's everything. It's very exciting. Lots of cool stuff. Lots of awesome, awesome new stuff. So I'm looking forward to, um, doing some parties. Lots of Facebook parties have been going super well. So uh, doing Facebook parties uh, has been a blessing, I think, for many people. Uh, people can shop easily online and not have to worry about having going to the grocery store if they don't want to or if they're not comfortable or maybe they have a compromised immune system and they can't. Like, um, let's get the word out there. Let's show these products. Uh, booking for, you know, a new product showcase 
and just doing this as a party is something that I want to do. So I'm looking forward to connecting with customers and getting shows on the books and then doing some in-home ones because I would love to just get away and talk to adults and not just children. Only. Anyways, have a great day, you guys. I hope you enjoyed the showcase and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.